Yeah, tickets of dua. It's a month of dua. The fasting person's dua is accepted, inshallah. And the one who's about to break his fast has a da'wah, inshallah, that will not be rejected according to sound, authentic narrations from the Prophet Muhammad We need to actually utilize and take advantage of the dua. But how do we make dua? You make dua by choosing the right times. And there are many. You can refer to books authored on this issue between Adhan and Iqamah in the state of sujood and I would, want, I would like to focus on the time in the state of sujood. The Prophet sallallahu said, أَقْرَبُ مَا يَكُونُ الْعَبْدُ مِنْ رَبِّهِ عَزَّ وَجَلْ وَهُوَ سَاجِدٌ فَأَكْثِرُوا فِيهِ مِنَ الدُّعَاءِ The closest to slave is to Allah is when he is in the least stage, state, which is in the state of sujood. So increase in your dua. And that goes, again I repeat, that goes for the farida and the voluntary, that goes in Arabic or any language you speak. You may make dua in the Farida in Urdu, in any language you speak. But we are highly encouraged to learn Arabic and make the same adiyah in Arabic. Until such time, one may make dua in his language. Those who say otherwise have no sound evidence for that. Allah Azza wa Jal is the creator of languages. And there is fatawa from Shaykh Ibn Uthameen and other mashaykh that this is okay. Because I get this question in email almost every week. You can make dua in your language, in Farida, in Sujood. In another narration, the Prophet ﷺ said, I was prohibited from reciting the Quran in the state of Ruku' or Sujood. As for Ruku' then magnify the, the Master, magnify Allah. As for the Sujood, then ask Allah abundantly, because it is very likely that Allah will respond to you. So we need to choose the times of making dua. Now,